Phenofibrate is a medication that, when used alongside a proper diet, can help lower bad cholesterol and fats in the blood, while also raising good cholesterol. It achieves this by increasing the natural substance that breaks down fats in the blood. This medication falls under the group of drugs known as fibrates. For individuals with very high triglyceride levels, lowering these levels with phenofibrate may reduce the risk of pancreas disease. However, it's important to note that phenofibrate may not lower the risk of a heart attack or stroke. It's essential to talk to your doctor about the risks and benefits of using phenofibrate. In addition to following a proper diet, other lifestyle changes that may enhance the effectiveness of this medication include exercising, losing weight if overweight, and quitting smoking. Be sure to consult your doctor for more details. As for the daily dosage and optimal timing of taking phenofibrate, this should be discussed with your healthcare provider. When taking phenofibrate, make sure to follow your doctor's instructions and take it by mouth once daily. There are different types of capsules and tablets, so be sure to ask your pharmacist about the specific brand you have. Some forms should be taken with food, while others can be taken with or without. The dosage will depend on your medical condition and how you respond to the treatment. If you are also taking other medications to lower your cholesterol, make sure to take phenofibrate at least one hour before or four to six hours after those medications to ensure proper absorption. It's important to take this medication regularly at the same time each day to get the most benefit. Do not change your dosage or use it more often than prescribed. Keep in mind that it may take up to two months before you see the full benefit of this medication, so it's important to continue following your doctor's advice on diet and exercise. Even if you start feeling better, don't stop taking the medication without consulting your doctor. It's important to remember that your doctor has prescribed this medication because they believe the benefits outweigh the potential side effects. While most people do not experience serious side effects, it's important to be aware of the possible risks. In some cases, phenofibrate may rarely cause gallstones, liver problems, or muscle issues. If you experience nausea, vomiting, loss of appetite, stomach pain, yellowing of the skin or eyes, dark urine, muscle pain, weakness, or signs of kidney problems, it's important to seek medical attention right away. Additionally, there is a rare possibility of a paradoxical reaction that can cause a severe decrease in good cholesterol levels. It's important to have your cholesterol levels regularly monitored by your doctor. If you notice any serious side effects, such as easy bruising, unusual tiredness, chest pain, or signs of infection, it's important to seek medical help immediately. While allergic reactions are rare, if you experience symptoms such as rash, swelling, severe dizziness, or trouble breathing, it's crucial to seek medical help right away. This is not a complete list of possible side effects, so if you have any concerns or notice any other effects, it's important to contact your doctor or pharmacist. Before starting phenofibrate, it's important to let your doctor or pharmacist know if you have any allergies to this medication or other similar medications. This is because there may be inactive ingredients in the product that can cause allergic reactions. Before using phenofibrate, make sure to inform your doctor or pharmacist about your medical history, especially if you have kidney disease, gallbladder disease, liver disease, or if you consume alcohol. If you are planning to have surgery, it's crucial to inform your doctor or dentist about all the medications and herbal products you are using. If you are pregnant, phenofibrate should only be used if it's absolutely necessary. It's important to discuss the risks and benefits with your doctor. It's unclear whether this medication passes into breast milk, so it's not recommended to breastfeed while using this drug and for five days after stopping the drug. Make sure to consult your doctor before breastfeeding. When taking phenofibrate, it's important to follow the dosage and timing recommended by your doctor for the best results. It is important to be aware of potential drug interactions with phenofibrate. It is possible that the way your medications work could be affected, or your risk for serious side effects could increase. This is not a complete list of all possible drug interactions, so it's important to keep a list of all products you use and share it with your doctor and pharmacist. Do not start, stop, or change the dosage of any medicines without your doctor's approval. One product that may interact with phenofibrate is blood thinners such as warfarin. It's important to be cautious when taking phenofibrate alongside these medications. 
It's also important to note that phenofibrate is very similar to phenofibric acid, so it's not recommended to use medications containing phenofibric acid while using phenofibrate. This could potentially cause complications or negative effects on your health. Always consult with your doctor before starting or stopping any medications. If someone has taken too much phenofibrate and is experiencing severe symptoms like passing out or difficulty breathing, it's important to seek immediate medical attention. In the U.S., you can call your local poison control center at 1-800-222-1222, and in Canada, you can call a provincial poison control center. It's important not to share your phenofibrate medication with others. While taking this medication, you should have regular lab and medical tests to monitor your cholesterol and triglyceride levels, as well as your kidney and liver function. It's important to keep all your medical and lab appointments and consult your doctor for more details. This will help ensure that you are getting the full benefit of the medication and that it is working effectively for you. If you forget to take a dose, take it as soon as you remember. If it's almost time for your next dose, just skip the one you missed and take the next dose at your regular time. Don't take a double dose to make up for the missed one. When it comes to storing phenofibrate, it's important to keep it at room temperature, away from light and moisture. Different brands may have different storage requirements, so be sure to check the product package or ask your pharmacist for specific instructions. It's also important to keep all medications out of reach of children and pets, and to avoid storing them in the bathroom. When it comes to disposing of phenofibrate, it's important to not flush it down the toilet or pour it into a drain unless specifically instructed to do so. Instead, consult your pharmacist or local waste disposal company for the proper way to discard the medication when it's expired or no longer needed. And as always, be sure to follow their recommendations to ensure proper and safe disposal. If you need more help, call your doctor for medical advice. In the US, you call FDA, 1-800-FDA-1088. In Canada, you may call Health Canada, 1-866-234-2345. Wishing you good health. Thanks for watching.